You have reached Dwight Beach Confession. Good evening, bitches. 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 Hey, I'm gonna fuck who you with, boy. Get the fuck off my line. You're showing your cunt flowers. Why would you believe any of this? Well, oh, ma'am, the, the gentleman, he, he's the... The gentleman? Who is the fucking gentleman? Well, oh, ma'am, ma'am, please bring it down a notch. You need to learn proper masturbation skills. I wish your car would have my lot. That way I could punch you up with some ass. God bless. It's morphin' time. Morphin' time. Lawsuit time. Loser. Inappropriate. I'll yeah, fuck you to you! Well, you we'll... fucking god fucker! I'll call this number again! We're gonna call a lot. Hello, I see the chick. Come to my fucking head right now and I'll fucking put a knife in your fucking throat. Mmm, fuck yeah. Look, you piece of card just... No, I didn't, bro. Yeah, your mom took the hell out of another bit drunk. Uh, come right this mom. Gathering around to make a prank call. Wow. Your fucking wife loves it when I check her meter. I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a Kohler faucet <laughs> shirt right up your ass. I just got done blowing my boy Dwight and shit. Well, if you were doing your job, ma'am, and you would, you would walk into that room right now and pull out his pants and start jerking him off and showing him. Oh, you fucking dick. Did you fucking say that to me? You fucking asshole. Keep it down. I hope I hope your I hope your earphones were up nice and fucking loud. They were real good and loud. Yeah. Um, my protein bar is right there. See. I'm not, I'm not gonna was it? hang on a second. Hang on, hang on. Let me bring the Skype on. Hang on, hang on. We got the we got the shit. Hey shits. How's it going, shits? You're live. You're on with Dwight. What is your <laughs> yeah? What is your malfunction? Tell me. What is oh, no. what is your malfunction? What what is your number? What is your number? Yes, I'm crinkling my protein bar because it needs to be opened because it needs to go in. I mean, I was gonna complain about the crinkling noise. Like, hey, mute your microphone, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, that's me. See, I got a Fit Crunch peanut butter one. Yeah, fucking Chef Robert Irvine's peanut butter one. Yeah. Look how big it is. Look how big and dark it is. Yeah, look how, yeah, look how dark. Oh, yeah. It, look, it looks like some biracial, multiracial men ejaculated on the, on the same surface and it created art. You see that? That's great. It's good stuff. Ah! Well, drop the piece. But, yeah. We're here for a show. We're going to do a show. All right. So, thank you for tuning into the show. This is Dwight the Chain Prank Call Podcast, Machines Incorporated, LLC. If you have any problems, you'll have to contact our lawyer for refunds. Uh, we currently have uh, five five people, five co-hosts in here. We have Fax Machine Error, also known as AXPA, who runs Community Call Nights on Fridays in the Dwight Cord. Hi, how are you, sir? All right, good talk. Hello? Hi, how are you? Oh. I'm here. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, we also have the uh, tap tap draw jaw artist known as Mr. Clay, Mr. Mystical Science Theater Clay Three. Uh, he taps, he taps, and sometimes he draws. Uh, he was masturbating when we made the thing earlier. Uh, we have Nashby. Nashby is in Vegas currently. He's playing bingo on the slot machines. He will apprise us of any hobos or hookers that are walking by, and if he hits a jackpot. Uh, if it's not uh, $500 or more, I don't want to know anything about it. And then if it is $500 or more, uh, go ahead and deposit my 10% tithing into my PayPal. Thank you. Uh, we have Gordo here, old man Gordo, Gordo Machines Incorporated. Hello, all. It's good to be here. Oh, yeah. Uh, and we also have Salty Peanut. Salty Peanut is in the house. He has he has a hissing in the background that Axma tried to blame on me. It's because I'm black. It, it is because he's black. 
Um, if you'd like to help, or help, if you'd like to participate in the show in what I call the mini-game, over there we have the throne listing, which is what I was showing earlier. Um, shit, if you were into the intro. Uh, if you go there, there's an interrupter sound that goes down the line and it interrupts the calls, and the caller does hear it. It interrupts and it bugs the fuck out of them. It's a mini game you get to play in here. You can also do donations over PayPal, paypal.me forward slash Dwight PCN. I will read your message on the air. Uh, we also have the uh, Patreon, patreon.com forward slash Dwight PCN. Uh, we had a member join today. I will go find that member and uh, shout them out since they joined a little bit later, but they did pay for this month, so they are entitled to a shout out as well. I also have this stupid Bean Boozled thing that I've had sitting on my. I, I bought. Like, four of them. I haven't done this on the air, I don't think. But I decided for a $5 donation through PayPal or $5 contribution or if you buy something off of the throne, I will, I will, that'll be a kicker. I'll throw one of these things in. I've got it. Don't worry. We're not going to run out. I've got a shitload of refills of these. But Bean Boozle, nasty fucking beans. That's sitting right fucking there. So right now we're going to go ahead and do, and do a call. Thanks for calling, Jay. How can I help you? Yeah, hi. I have a question. I had come in there like three days ago and I got a scratcher ticket. You know what I'm talking about? Like a lotto ticket. Okay, I mean where? Well, I got a scratcher lotto ticket. Out of flying, Jay? Yeah. We don't have a lottery in the state of them. Yeah, you got it over there. You got the machine. What machine? The lottery machine that's next to the cashier, the next to the thing. What lottery machine we got in here? Lottery machine we got in here. Huh? You, we don't have no lottery machine. Tamisha is the one that sold it to me. I gave her $25 and she handed me this, this thing. I See, at first I thought it smelled a little bit like silver nail polish, but she handed it to me. She goes, here you go, guaranteed winner. And I was like, oh, thank you. And I didn't think about it until like, you know, until yesterday. I was like, oh, shit, I still got this. Ago? The three days ago, and I just thought about it today. I was like, the scratcher. You gave, you gave him. Oh, a lottery ticket, $25. Hello, how can I help you? Hi, the, the lottery ticket that you sold me, the private sale lottery ticket, it wasn't a winner. So what do I do now? Um, we don't sell lottery tickets. I know that because we, so, don't, we don't have that in the state of Alabama. We don't have lottery but what I was, uh-huh. you you said that this was under the table hush hush. It was something you ran on Facebook and who you guaranteed said that? you Nobody did. Nobody said that. You did. Who you, you? You don't even know who you is. Yeah, you're Tamisha, right? Yeah. Who? Yeah, that's who you. Who did that? You did, and you said guaranteed winner or my money back. Well, I'm I'm back for my money. How are you gonna not have no lottery in Alabama? Molly flavors. Hi. I'm, call, I'm calling about the job. Okay. Um, which one? And who do you need? Uh, which one are you looking at? Uh, for the cold food prep and the panties. Cold food prep. Yeah, panties. Okay, just a second. Cold panties, fish panties. Hello? Hi, I'm calling about the cold food panties prep. The pantry prep, yes. Yeah, panties prep, yeah. I want to. I was okay, wondering. So I was wondering if it was still if the position was still available. Yeah, it's still available. They're taking applications uh, pretty much Monday through Friday, eight to five. Mm-hmm. The address. Do you have pen and paper? I have pen, but no paper. Okay. Um, <laughs> I don't know what you're going to write the address on. I'll write it on my hand. I'll write it on my hand. Okay. So it's twenty one zero two. Yeah. West Vineyard, V I N E Y A R D Street in Wailuku. Okay. And um, a, I I don't know if this matters, but I I am bl- I'm visually impaired. I am blind. Okay, I'm not sure how how to. Well. What's that? I'm I'm sorry. I'm in the, I'm in the restroom right. I well. I hope this is the restroom. I'm. I've been feeling about... Somebody took my cane with the white end, so I can't feel around anymore. And, and I'm hoping this is oh. not a closet and it's the bathroom. Okay, well... I, I call it my morning I, go... I call it my morning goby. 
That's what, well, but it's nighttime. But because I'm blind, my days and nights get mixed up. So my morning goby is at right. night. Is at night right now. I'm pushing the goby. Okay. Well, it's. I'm not sure how to how to work around that because, I mean, the building is. Uh. We're not equipped necessarily for. Um, I don't even know how how to work that out. But um I I'm, I'm working it out right right as we as we speak. You mean like as far as what is there dangerous uh traps uh around there that well, a blind person it, might fall a, into? It's a, it's a multi uh level building. Right. So there oh. is ramps uh. and then there's certain places that there's a large step to go down, but that's not necessarily where you would be going. But Mm -hmm. um, there is a big drop from one part of the building to the other part. Okay. Uh, So it's like three buildings that they kind of combine. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! I'm sorry. I just got angry because I, I I felt that you 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 don't believe in my ability to negotiate my way around a building. I've been blind for twenty years. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm I got saying... angry. I got angry. Okay. Well. I felt uh... you were insulting my intelligence, and I just want to set the record straight. Well, that's not what I was doing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I take it back. Then I take it back. Well, you can, you have the address, you know where you can come and apply. Okay, so but but I, but I I should I keep my attitude or, or leave it at home when I come? Um, well, definitely if you're going to act like that, you need to leave it at home. Okay, so I shouldn't yell when I come in? Definitely not. Okay, what about, what, at what uh, octave level should I keep my voice below? Like what? What? What DBs? I would say what you're doing now is fine. Okay. So, so just, just my indoor voice, my indoor voice. Yes. Okay. I can work on that. I can work on that. Um, now, let me ask you about this. Are there are there uh, readily available bathrooms? Because I do have, um, I do have problems with my bowels and being pushed. There is. There is. Uh, bathrooms here, yes. There's okay, because my my Gobi waits for no for nobody, and like it'll just go where it goes. So as long as there's bathrooms every ten feet, uh, then I be I that should meet uh, Americans with Disabilities uh, Act. You should like that should be fine as long as there's bathroom every ten minutes. Well, the, the bathrooms or ten minutes, like, ten 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 um, feet, one ten feet. Area. How many? It's in one specific area. Mm-hmm. There's a women's and a men's, and there's one that's a little bit further up by the office. Okay, and I can use any of them? Except the women's one. That one's specifically for the women, but you can use the other two. Yeah, but but my but my, my bowels, my bowels, they go? So. Yes, there's, there's a handicap one that you can use, and there's a regular men's one, and then there's yeah. a... Women, so. Okay, hang, hang on just a second. I'm, yeah. get, I'm getting. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. See, see, I just get angry. You're questioning my abilities again. I, I'm explaining to you where the bathroom is. You asked me where the bathroom is. There's three bathrooms: one for women, one for men, and a handicapped bathroom. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm getting, I'm getting up off of the, off the toilet. Where's, hang on, where's the sink? I'm trying to find. Is that the sink? There's the sink. Oh my God, the sink! Hello. Yes, I'm here. I fell down. You need to be call- you need to call 911. No, no, hang on. I'm getting back up. 
Okay, I think I think I found the closet. I'm grabbing I'm grabbing a towel. Down that's the stairs. Hello? Yes, are you okay? Yeah, I I think I missed a step. I fell down two stairs, two steps. Hi, I'm Chef Will, Mommy Flavors Catering. Hi. Hi. So, uh Hi, I'm about I'm about to be your new your very clumsy pantry ch- uh sh- uh prep guy, cold prep. Okay. Um uh, let me see. I, I did get some applicants. You're welcome to come in and fill out. Um, I got, I'm not going to make a decision until Monday, but can you come by and fill out an application? Yeah. Uh, wait a minute. I thought I was in the back. I, I think I wandered into the pasture. She didn't explain to you I was blind, did she? I'm having difficulty finding my way around. Somebody took my cane. Oh, gosh. Um, and now I, huh. I, hear, I hear chickens. I hear goats. Chickens and goats. Yeah. Okay. I, I uh, we don't have any goats around our shop. I don't. Chickens in the bag. I, I can't. I can't find. I can't find. Okay. Where where do uh, I go? Where do I go? Oh, where where did you last go to? I was in the bathroom, and then I fell down some steps, and then now, I like I. Uh, I, went, I felt the door, and now it's, there's a breeze, and there's animals. I hear them. Wow, yeah, that doesn't sound anything like our shop. Where do I loop on video? Hey, you stupid yeah. asshole! Hey, you don't call me asshole. stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! What the fuck you're talking about! Hello? 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 If that was you, I don't think we're going any further. No, th- it was it was me. It was me, and I I I apologize. I thought you were insulting my intelligence, uh, like the last lady did too. And uh, the last lady was my wife. She was just asking you some simple questions. But they're not so simple for me. I understand that, but I don't expect to get yelled at in my ear after how many years I've been. I, in the I didn't. Ex- like I didn't. That. I to tell you the truth, I didn't expect that either. Okay. Um, well, let's but, continue with this. But then. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, let's continue, let's continue. Do you remember any landmarks that you were close to before you lost your cane? Well, no, the, see, that got stolen yesterday, so I've been, I've been just usually using manual, using manual hands and moving about, and so, but the cane gives me extra reach so I can tap in front of me, and it, 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 it helps me, um, detect any type of, um, obstacles or hazards that are in front of me. That's essentially what it's used for. But I have a sonar. I have a special one. It has a sonar on it and it beeps for me uh, when any objects are taller than, than one and a half feet. And so like if it detects an animal or it detects um, a bump or a hole and I have a little earpiece and it beeps and each beep or you know the, the pattern of the beep does something uh, does something different and then um, so like I'm having a hell of a time and like I said, I wandered outside and now I don't hear the animals anymore. Yeah. Yeah. It's very quiet now. Yeah. That's, huh. that's what I'm saying. And like, I'm not feeling a door, but I don't feel that I'm trapped, but it's very cold. That is, that is strange. I, I'm not exactly sure where you're at. No, um, like I'm, I, I hear cars. Um, well, yeah, there is a street right next to us. There's that Vineyard yeah. Street, and we just had some loud cars driving up it. Yeah, I have a car. Like, there's there's a car near me. 
I, I, oh, there's a car starting. I heard it. Um, I heard that. I heard, I heard that. Uh, I must, I'm gonna go this way. I hope, uh, I think this is the sidewalk. I'm gonna walk. Okay. I think this is the you sidewalk. You might be walking on Vineyard Street in the front of the building. It could, it could be. Get out of the, oh, what was that? Something breezed by me. Something breezed by me real quick. I, hello? Does anybody know what that was? Hello? It, uh, it blew my hair back, whatever it was. Well, that sounded like a bunch of trucks driving by you. Well, that would explain it because my hair, I have long, luscious hair. I have, I have the I have the locks just like Dog the Bounty Hunter. God bless his soul. But my hair blew, my mullet, my mullet went into the wind. Huh. Okay, well, I'm out on Vineyard Street. I don't, what, why is this car honking at me? I don't know. I'm looking down the street. I don't see you. I I don't. You I, might. I don't know. But like it's it's. I don't understand. Like people are. They're, they're, I don't understand, and I'm very confused. And I keep yelling Marco Polo, and nobody will help me. Oh, geez. yeah, I understand that. Um. Well, you might be on the main street, yeah. which is going up and down the hill here. Uh, do you feel like you're going up or down a hill? Uh, Hello. Hello. Do you, do you feel like you're going up or down a hill? I I feel I um, my legs are strained like I'm going up. Marco, okay, you, might, you might be going up uh, Main Street. Okay, this sure is an easy street. I'll tell you that. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't sound. Too oh, there's good. another. There's another man. Hello. Hello. Hey, sir. Hello. Hey, I, I got your bumper. It flew into my car. I was just coming to give it back to you. <laughs> that got him to hang up. Five wow. Five. Like that whole fucking call was, it has ups. It has so many twists and turns. And then I I don't know who did oh Jesus Christ I got a lot of stuff to cover from that call. All right, I do see Ted did the the wait a minute. Um the duster the duster thing. I saw that. So let me go to the screen. Uh and I was actually just talking to my son about this the other day cuz I need to take the uh tempered glass off of my computer machine and do the inside. Uh, and he needs to do his insights. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! God damn it, that is so fucking loud! And it's so unexpected. People are laughing about my surprise fate. Now, fuck you! It's scary and it's very loud. Hello? Hello? Hi, did you... Hey, listen. Did you call down here to the community college and make a complaint about the phone call I made to you last night? I didn't call the college at all. The cops did. Okay, well, why would you have the cops call the community college? They almost kicked because me out of my I'm classes. Your bullshit. Don't call my number again. No, they almost to jail. they almost kicked me out of my classes. Well, that just says shit. Don't be calling my number. Well, are you gonna re are you gonna reimburse me for my classes if I get kicked out? You ass. That is your fault, not mine, retard. Hey, hey, let's watch the R words, sir. This is an enlightenment community now. <laughs> <laughs> uh, fucking old gravel, <laughs> old gravel mouth there. <laughs> uh, for uh, well, we're gonna give him a minute, and then I'm gonna call him. Yeah, motherfucker, if you think you're so bad, meet me here by the water tower. Hey, listen, I just got my college. I just got my college guidance counselor on the phone. Uh, this is Mr. Ted. He's my guidance counselor. You got to speak with him. I. Hi, I'm the guidance counselor, <laughs> and <laughs> hey, shut up, asshole! Hey, Expo, you want to dial that number? You you want to dial that? It sounds like somebody's got a fucking attitude problems. Uh, IRC days, boy, do I remember IRC days? It's going. Thank you. Who's this? Hey, 
You want into information about what? the Toyota Camry, but you're what? awful mouthy now, motherfucker. Who's this? Hey, my name is Dwight. <laughs> Who? Dwight. D W I G H T. I'm looking for Tiffany. Dwight? Looking for Tiffany. Yes. Uh, she's not here at the moment. Can I take a message? Yeah, tell her that she can take the ad down about the Toyota. It wasn't stolen, it's just mine. It wasn't stolen, it was just yours? Yeah, I, I bought it from Sofina. I, I bought it from Sofina. Okay. So she can take okay. it She can take oh, okay. it down. Okay. So I am the new owner. But I, I, what I'm saying, I don't understand how, how she you bought it off of her when it wasn't her car. I bought it. Well, she said she, that she was going to be mailing me the title because I gave her the money and she said there was a problem at the Secretary of State. And so she said that uh, give her so two she weeks. Stole, she 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 stole she stole that car from somebody that went to jail. Did somebody went? How do you? Uh, I guess I'm confused. Uh, somebody that went to jail. Okay, somebody went to jail. Somebody went to jail, and, and their car was at their at their residence. Uh-huh. That person broke into this to their house, took the keys, and stole the car. Oh, f- are you fucking kidding me? No way. Okay. I'm honest. Oh shit. Okay. Um, I'm driving it right. Like, hang on. I'm gonna start. Hey, the... hey, if you could do me a favor. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, cause do me a favor because we're trying to get the car back. Yeah. Where do you want to meet? I'll bring. I'll bring it to you, and then I'll. I'll just have to have the cops arrest this lady, or I'll get my money back from her somehow. Yes, sir. Well, okay. Well, let me get a hold of Tiffany, and then I'll talk. Is this a number? Can I have a number to reach you? Yeah. Call me back at this at this number. Um, I'm just heading over to Walmart right now. I'm just heading to Walmart right now. I'm just heading to Walmart. Oh, no. Ah! Oh, my God. You wrecked the car. That's just a fender bender. That can be pulled yeah, it's out. It's not even our car, and you just smashed it into pieces. What the fuck are you doing? You just ruined the car. What? Oh, is he on the phone? Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. I, I dropped the phone somewhere. It doesn't matter because he. I mean, he wanted it back, so they'll they'll take no, it. Where the fuck? Did. I think I dropped the phone between the seats. But yeah, he wants if the he car finds back. Out but that you ruined the car. Yeah, well, he's gonna be more pissed. If he finds out I ruined it on purpose. Where's the phone? Hey, check on, check under your out. seat. Check under your seat. See if it's hey. under there. See if it's hey, under the seat. Hey. Don't I worry about it. it. Don't, don't worry about it, sir. Hey, don't worry. Hey, don't worry about it, sir. Uh, we're we're going to find it eventually. You know what I mean? Hey, don't worry, I hear, I hear the phone. Hey, hey it's, it's under your seat. Check and I see if it's under your seat. Yeah, it's under here. I hear it. no money. What did he want? Was he actually being nice about it? He's like, don't worry about it? Is that what he said? Yeah, yeah, he's like, oh, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. We'll find it eventually or something? I don't know. He was more is. pissed off when I was calling with a blocked number than he was wrecking the fucking car. It's interesting. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Hi, hey, listen. I'm down in the tunnels underneath your house. Your what? I My cat got loose and I was trying to find my cat. And I ended up under the under your house in the tunnels. In the tunnel. Yeah, is that is that you, Don? Oh, oh yeah, the underneath that part, yes, sir. Yeah, Don. I know you're talking. Is, I, it, I, I, is this you, Don? Y- yes, sir, it is. Okay, well, I'm I'm under here right now, and I'm still trying to find my kitty cat, Sherbert, but I I can't find him. But you know, you got a bunch of loose wires hanging down through here. Underneath the that little tunnel? Yeah, like I think they go to your house, and I was tugging no, on them. A, yeah, I don't, I don't think it's anything to be worried about there. Yeah, but the 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 white the, like the wires are hanging, and the and the pipes, the pipes are all rusted in, and, and and they got holes in them. There's a lot of water down here. Where in the? Where are you talking about your ass? I'm under your house, directly under your house. 
How in the world can you, are you sure you're calling the right place? Yeah, I went in one of the storm drains over here on Sage Street. And I was following the cat and I went in and, and now I'm all turned around and lost. But I'm under your house, I'm using GPS and the map says I'm directly under your house. You mean under my store? Yeah. Because you, you're saying it's my house. Well, it's it's a dwelling is what I should be calling it. But I've, I'm under here and it's really weird. I've I've stumbled upon like, I don't know if this is an ancient race of alien beings or what this is. I have no idea. I've never been under there before. Okay, but what what do I do? Like, hang on. Do you see any lights turning on and off? Because I'm pulling on the on the electrical wires okay. right now. Okay, listen. I'm 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 not. I don't live inside Threads. I, I don't. Think oh my god! Right oh my god, Don! The 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 aliens are shooting back. Don, Don, I need reinforcements. Oh, shut up. Shut the hell up. <laughs> that was great. I love the ability of this what app to be able to uh, just do a quick search for a fucking sound that you want and just boo, 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 and just fucking go. It's just called My Soundboard, and it's it's available on the App Store. It's fucking good. <laughs> He said, it's his voicemail says Jamie something or other. How the fuck's he gonna go? Nah, that ain't me, bro. Wrong number. That ain't me. Wrong I'm number. Hey, <laughs> milkman. Oh, milk yeah. Howdy, howdy. Hey, How hey milkman. Milk I love your family. So good to hear y'all. Sorry to join you late, but I can see things oh, are going well. Better than Well, you know what? You know what? You're still. You still made it here before cat. <laughs> that's that's right, that's the real that. gauge. That's the real gauge. For movie time, everybody. See? So yeah, yeah. Go. She she Show claims up. she'll be back for movie night, so she's got uh, an hour and twenty two minutes to get her fucking ass home. She got an hour. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> Uh, have to do a truck. You have to do a truck call to get her in here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, who said that? Do you still have that sound bite where the guy says? Put my mouth on that pussy and drink that juice, baby. Uh, yeah, of course I do. I'll I've never heard that. that. Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? You never heard it, Ted? Yeah. I've never heard this. Oh, oh yeah. Hang on. Um, it's in my sound bites. I don't have it. I don't think I have it on the uh, tablet, but. Uh... I can put my mouth over your pussy and just drink that juice. I can put my. <laughs> Drink that juice, oh, baby. Like the music that, he plays an acoustic guitar in the background. It's really cool. Oh yeah, yeah. The the fucking song I made, Ted. Yeah. Uh, the oh, fucking, the... the creepers. Uh... <laughs> oh, this. <laughs> this is the same. I'm angry now. Oh my god. He's gonna make you talk dirty. He's gonna make you squeal like a pig. I can put my mouth over your pussy and just try to catch this, baby. <laughs> baby, I know some titties are just poking for your little t-shirt there. That oh, nipples are standing around the red. Oh, yeah. I hope this guy never got laid. I love to drink that pussy kiss. Yeah, <laughs> I need some nourishment, baby. You got nice long nipples. Something that I can suck nice on. Long ones. And twirl my tongue around. Oh yeah, long ones. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. I love to suck on that pussy. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> You want to get raped? Okay, that's Whoa. that's that's where you end that. All right, yeah, get off the track there. Uh, I can call him and let me know. Off the track. <laughs> I, do, I, I, I do give that guy credit though. At least he asked. So he's like, that's true. I have a Does question it for you. If you ask? I don't think so. I think I think no, that uh, all that just changes right to consensual. Close as he could get it though. <laughs> 
remember one specifically, and I wish I could find the show, but Carlita was on with me. And we were trying to get these women to be servers and bartenders at a party. We're going to have a huge party. One of the ladies I kept trying to talk into having quote unquote sex with Carrot Top because Carrot Top was going to be a big celebrity we were having there. Fucking like ACDC Metallica <laughs> were the bands. We had, yeah, yeah, we had Carrot Top. And I'm like, listen, I showed Carrot Top your picture from the email. He <laughs> says he's got 10,000 if you'll sleep with him. And like the girl was fucking like, oh, like I don't know, I don't know. And like she was almost into it at the end. Uh, but Carlito started talking to one of the waitresses. And he's like, yeah, at this certain time, we're going to have a food fight. He goes, we're going to start throwing chairs. He goes, we're going to start throwing big full-size cooked hams and turkeys at each other. Like, he's just like, he's like, yeah. He's like, we got to have you come because a woman died last year because I hit her in the head with a frozen turkey. I didn't know it wasn't <laughs> cooked. <laughs> he, he's basically murdering people in the fucking call from a food fight. He's like, oh, you're fucking, you know, I fucking hit her in the head. She went down. She died. <laughs> Carlita, I didn't know it wasn't cooked. Oh, you didn't know this fucking frozen cold to the touch turkey wasn't cooked when you rifled it at someone's fucking head? <laughs> fucking Carlito. I'm, I'm, but I have started going through like my 2014, 2015 calls. Uh, or shows and editing them. Oh my god, the one I did um I did a couple weeks ago for the Patreons when I took time off. I edited one of those to put up. Uh let me see. I think it's in this one right here. Good evening, bitches. Yeah, bitches. yeah, yeah. We don't need the fucking intro. Fuck it. And this show Neon was on. Uh Awkward was on. General Awesome. There's a fucking throwback. General Awesome was on. Uh he's the one that did the original Dwight intro actually. And they never gave me the master track, and now we can't alter it because he's a motherfucker. Uh, yeah. So let's see if we could just find Labradors it. do that. Oh, yeah. Still, this was the first instance of him talking about Homer, like getting getting like a dog. He's like, oh, I want a dog. You want the hound? And he's like, I think he's oh, like, no. The person at extension. Hey, fuck you. They, their personality stays like a puppy their whole life. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they'll, they'll, I think the golden lambs intrinsically shake your hand, I think, if you stick it out. Is that true? I don't know. They, what, I, my, they learn it really easily. I think. My cousin had a, a golden lab, and but happy See, to deliver. <coughs> I I think it'd be cool to have a basset hound or like a, just like a bloodhound. That'd be awesome. Bloodhounds seem pretty chill, but my wife says no, they howl a lot. All right. Do they? So she said that all the hounds are like they just you know they bray all the time. She said, "I was like, well, we can get the vocal cords cut," and she called me a monster. <laughs> But that was that, <laughs> it edited out to like uh, an hour. Uh, but there was a lot of good shit in there. And I gave that to the patrons a couple weeks back. He uh, did cut the vocal cords out too. And it was fine. Did, did he actually do that with Homer? Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh. he cut out his vocal cords. <laughs> actually, you know what he did? He reinserted him in his own voice at the end. There. That's why he, he put a so fucking cool. voice box <laughs> into into <laughs> Homer so then he only said Carlito things. Rrr, 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 I'm Carlito. It's like it's like declawing a cat. Carlito <laughs> oh. installed his voice in the Homer. See, so that's got even funnier. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Hello. Hey, did you leave the gate to the tunnels open? Because I fell down in here and I can't get out. I'm sorry. Uh, did you leave the gate to the tunnels open? Because I can't. I can't get out from under the under the uh, restaurant. No, we didn't, we left it open. Yeah, I'm under I'm underneath the the restaurant right now. There's all kinds of pipes and stuff exposed. Well, I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay, but are these your pipes? It's wide open. <laughs> are these your pipes? I don't know. I have no idea. Well, if you don't say the your pipes, I'm see. I'm a bit of of a grifter and a scrapper. I'm going to start sawing all the pipes, and I'm going to take them with me, and I'm going to go trade them in for money. Can you take a picture and send it to me? Do you want me to text it to you? Yeah. Okay, because I'm starting to take pipes, so if you lose water pressure, don't be alarmed. So you're digging the ground right now? I'm underground. I'm taking the pipes. So the ground is... I'm, yeah, under, I'm underground, yeah. No, no, I'm underground. I dug underneath. I'm in the tunnels. Wow. 
I don't know what tunnel you're talking about. It's listen, it's like the underground railroad of Hawaii. You know, when they freed the slaves. But but Hawaii, yeah. like nobody knows about these tunnels under here. Where are you calling from? I'm under I'm in Hawaii. I'm underneath your restaurant. I'm underneath Raising Canes. Okay. And I want to know if I could take your pipes. I don't know. You can ask the police when they come. Why the police? Don't tell them about the tunnels. That's how I run all of my pipes. I don't know. They're, they're, I just, I just, I just told my manager to call. So no, go by the hey, day. go by the men's toilet. I'm gonna shake the pipes. Tell me if this goes in, into the toilets. I'm shaking the okay. pipe. I'm shaking the pipe right now. Go look. He left. Ah, fuck him. First he went from there's no tunnels to don't take my pipes to I'm, I'm calling the cops. They're going to send the cops down there with a tracking dog. Easter. Like service. Hello? 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 Hi. Listen, I, I drove yes. the car into one of the tunnels and I don't know how to get out. Are you talking about... Oh, wait. You... Drove a car out to the tunnel. Yeah, I th- this I took a sign the wrong way and it said to go right, but I went left and I'm in a tunnel. I think it's at the base of the volcano. Oh, you have to go. You have to reverse in. But I, I reverse out. But I can't, I put it in reverse and all it does is make a loud revving sound. Oh. Like I'm in, I mean, I got out and I'm looking around because I'm trying to see how I get out. There, there's a lot of like crates of food and water in here. It looks like old military gear. Oh, I don't know where you at. I'm, 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 I'm stuck where in here. Hang on, hang on, a, hang on a second. Hello. Hello. No, no, yeah. I'm trying to see if anybody can hear me in here. Hello. I don't think they can hear me, sir. Okay, I, what, what car are you driving? I'm in a Jeep. Why don't you honk your Jeep? I honk your horn. I'm try- see, I honk, but nobody, see, nobody, like it just echoes in here. Yeah. And so I'm having a lot of problems. Oh, interesting. And I'm starting to freak out. Just you, just by, by yourself? Yeah, I'm I'm by myself. I'm on vacation and I I'm doing sex tourism. And that's why I got the nice Jeep cuz I figured the ladies would like it and, and, and I'm all by myself and I'm in the tunnel. Uh, okay, good luck cuz I, I don't know how to help you. We're, we're a car, we are a car service. Do you want your car back? <laughs> good luck. Hello? Hello? I'm in the bathroom. Okay. And I'm in here right now and I'm unzipping my pants. How do, what do I do next? There's no tissues in your room? No, there's no, there's no tissues and I'm pulling, I put, my pecker is already out and it's not going to hold in any longer. Okay, what's your room number? I'm in, I'm in, I'm in 10. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in 10. Sorry? You know ten? Oh no! Oh, the shit! The Three. shit is coming out of my ass. Oh. Three one zero, right? Three three ten. Yes, but the shit is coming out. What do I do? No, I'm bringing you the tissue. But I'm shit. I'm shitting. I'm shitting on the bed and on the floor. What do I do? Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm no. I'm bringing you the tissue. Oh, oh, how many it. tissue? Oh. Oh. I'm in the hole. Oh. Hole one. Oh, oh, you went. oh, this is a mess. Oh, it's so soupy. Oh, it's Campbell's soup. It should be canned. Oh, Michael Strahan's mother would be so proud of him. Oh, oh, oh. I'm, I'm coming to your room. Uh, oh, no, there's a man in here. Hey, you stupid asshole. Hey, you stupid asshole. You don't call me You don't know what the fuck you're talking you about. What the fuck you're talking about. Jesus Christ. Yeah. 
I don't know why it gave me the fucking chills right there, but it did. Yes. Yeah, hi. I'm in my room, and I think somebody's playing some sort of trick on me. Um, when I lay down on my pillow, and it's making a funny noise. Uh, what do you mean, in your room? Yeah, like, hang on. Let me, I'm going to sit down, let me sit down on the bed real quick. And so I go on and I lean back. I either lay my head on the bed, on the pillow, or I lean back. Here, let me lean back real quick. I'm on the pillow. Oh. See, now it's making, it's making some stupid sound every time I lean back on the pillow. Uh, is it happening in your room or is it coming from the next room? No, it's coming from the pillow. So like I lean for, so I'm off of the pillow now and now I, I'm, I'm going to lean back on it again. <sighs> See, it, it did it again. Yeah, I'm not sure. It's making like a fart sound. Yeah, there's not much we can do on that. Yeah, well, I need a different pillow because I'm not going to listen to this this all night. Hello. Hi. Yeah, I don't know what we can do. Uh, uh, it's, it's just a pillow, you know. Yeah, but you don't hear that. You don't hear the pillow fart. You can switch the pillow, you know, put a different pillow. What type of pillow? Do you have a pillow for my pillow guy? All the pillows are doing like that, or? But all the all the pillows in my room, yeah. I need a different pillow. Yeah, is, is every one of them is doing that, or yeah. just one pillow? No, is doing no, that? all the pillows. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't know. Let me see if we have any extra pillows. Like I need a, a pillow that doesn't have feathers in it because I'm allergic to uh, avian. I get the avian flu one time. Okay, I don't know if you have any different types. Uh, they're all similar pillows. Okay, and when? When I get? What room are you in? I, I'm in room 15, 115. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! Yeah, don't insult my intelligence. I don't like having to get loud like that. Uh, who, who's that? I mean, I don't want this kind of talk. No, that was, uh, that was Juan. Did, did you want to talk to Juan or no? Because Juan, Juan is the one that said it. It, was, it wasn't me. I don't get aggravated like that, but Juan... Okay, Juan he needs happy. to quiet down, please. Juan, you gotta... Don't make noise like that. Juan, you gotta quiet down. You're gonna make people mad in the rooms next door. You can't be so loud. I told him. I told him. He should be fine. He... He... Every now and again, he, he gets really aggravated. He lost a lot of money today. He was betting on college football. Yeah, he needs to quiet down, otherwise I'm going to have to call a cop. This is too much noise. Okay. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! He's very... He's very... That time it was cracking bottles. I thought Juan went in for a double dip. Oh, fuck me. Poor Juan, boy, he's having a tough night. <laughs> fucking, fucking cracking bottles just implicated Juan in some fucking crap. And I was about to go to the uh, the the page to play that sound bite, and fucking here comes cracking, just fucking ripping through, ripping through. Just... Hi, I'm sorry about Juan. Yeah, he needs to quiet down, man. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to. Do something about it. Okay, well, what what will you do to him? I'll, I'll relay it to I'll him. I'll call the cops. Okay, Juan, listen. He says that he will he will, will leave without a, any type of refund. He's going to kick us out. And we, we can't do that because every place that we've checked out around here, it, they're full. They're full, okay? Listen, I've, ex I've explained it to him. He's not going to do it anymore. He's promised me. He, he won't do it anymore. He's going to well, use his... Please down. He will. He's going to use... I'll, I'll, get, I'll get quiet, too. He's going to use his church voice. Um, that way people aren't disturbed. Because that's what you're you're worried about, right? Is uh, other guests yes. getting getting disturbed? Okay. So yes. I, I apologize on his behalf. We're both uh, Christian-leaning individuals. And, like, I just... I, I, I profusely... 
uh, apologize. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about! Did you leave? Oh, he left. Hi, Marilyn. Uh, I'm trying to reach my wife. Uh, she's in room 112. Could I be transferred, please? Yeah, um, I have have to have you call right back so I can answer on the switchboard. Oh, sure, sure. I understand. Yeah, I'll call right back. Okay. Thank you. All right, sounds like this is going to be easy. Hello? Hi, is this room 112? Yes. Hi, uh, this is Dwight. I'm calling from the front desk. How are you this evening? Um, good. Okay. Great, great. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. Listen, the reason I'm... Di- I, and I hate to disturb you at such an hour, uh, but I wanted to let you know uh, that we're going to need to, in the next uh, 45 minutes or so, uh, have you check out. What? Yeah, we're going to we're gonna have, to have to ask you to vacate the room. Uh, what now? Well, we have a local celebrity coming in, uh, and he always stays in room 112. And so what we're going to do is we're going to ask you to leave... Uh, so he can come and have his, uh, what, he has a standing reservation for this room. you got to be kidding. No. Uh, un- unfortunately, uh, 45 minutes is the longest that we're going to be able to give you because we're, we're calling in our housekeeping. Uh, they're going to go ahead and do a sweep of the room and they're going to fumigate it because we don't know what type of bugs you may or may not have brought in with you. Uh, it's just so we can get the room up to his standards. Hi, table up with you. How may I help you? Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm okay. How are you? I'm I'm good. Listen, I came in. Uh, I I I need to. Uh, I want to. I want to be. I want to. I want to be hired for front of house. I'm sorry. There's a position. I'm sorry. Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What? No, that was me. That was my father. I was telling him that I'm going to get this job with you guys that I was calling because he's threatening to kick me out right now. And I called him. I said, don't, you know, I was joking. I said, don't be a stupid. And he just yelled at me. Like, that's not a good look if I'm trying to get a job. I'm trying to get a job with you. And that's not a good look for him to yell at you when I'm on the phone. Okay. Um, so did someone here talk to you? Uh, No, no. I'm calling to talk to you. Okay. About getting a job here? Yeah, yeah. I okay. I think it was for um, I think it was for like second. I think it was for like uh server and hostess were the positions front of the house. Okay. Did someone tell you about a job here? Uh yeah, do you know uh do, do you know Kitty Kitty Bono or yeah, Kitty, I do not. You don't? I can go I'm the hostess, but I can get you can you oh, give me a I love second? your I love your cakes. Can you give me one second, please? Yeah, but how long is one second? Because I would really. Uh, okay. Um, it'll be a couple minutes. Just let me talk to my manager for a second, please. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're not mad at what my father said, right? Because you sound a little ex- no. exasperated or something. No. Okay. He didn't hurt your fe- just... he didn't hurt your feelings or nothing. No, no, no. I just I can't help you. I'm just the hostess but I can get you in touch with my manager, okay? Okay. okay. I just need a minute to do that. Is it because he's a man? No, no, it's, it's, she's a woman, actually. It's a woman. Okay, okay, good, good. Because I would, I, would I would hate to think that in this day and age that there's a man trying to tell you what to do with your body. Oh, it's okay. Can I put you on hold now, please? Well, can you just put the phone down? I'd rather not listen to hold music. I have very sensitive okay. ears. Okay, okay. My father yelled at me. Hello, this is Tablet Poi Poo. How may I help you? Hi, I, I was calling about the server and hostess position. Yes. And I was just wondering if it was still available and, and how I may go about uh, being hired for such a position. You can come by and pick up an application during business hours. Okay. Um, uh, we have them out front and then schedule uh, somebody in touch with you to schedule an appoint, you know, an interview. Uh huh. From is there? It, is it a phone interview, a Zoom interview? Uh, what is no, the it interview? is not. And, and what is the... Um, I hey, you stupid asshole! Hey, you stupid asshole! Don't call me stupid! You don't know what the fuck you're talking about!
about? Uh, sorry, that's my father. That's my father. Hello, thank you for calling the Boiling Crab Salt Caca. Go listen to my hell on you speaking. How can I help you? What's that? I couldn't hear you. Can you repeat all of that? Okay, um, this is the Boiling Crab Salt Caca. Go listen to my hell on you speaking. How can I help you? Hi, uh, do you have a uh, soft shell blue crab? I'm um, not blue crab, but we do have soft shell crab. Soft shell. Well, listen, I, I'm calling about the job position. Uh, I saw a listing saying that I could come in and I could be the one to pull the legs off of all the lobsters and crabs, and I want to do that. Uh. Wait, what? Yeah, it said it said that they needed an arm puller. They said that I could come in and I pull all the crabs, and I I could yank all the all the arms and the legs off of the crabs so we can make extra money. Okay, give me one second. Okay, tell him, tell him I'm the crab yanker. Hi, this is Holly. How can I help you? Hi, Holly. Uh, I was calling about the, I saw the ad uh, for the gentleman. That, I want to be the gentleman that gets to yank the crabs. I want to yank the arms and the legs off the crabs. Um, this is not the establishment that has that position open. But no, that's what it says. It says kitchen help. Are you good at yanking legs and arms off of crabs? That's what it says. For the boiling crab? Yeah. And, and, and I'm a steadfast vegan, and I would only yank the arms and legs, like no killing. I don't want to kill the crab. I just want to, I want it to feel pain. Well, if you want to, I mean, if you want to apply for a job that's posted for us, yeah. you're more than welcome to come into the restaurant and grab an application. Okay. Because I, I, yeah. do, I just can't do adult films anymore. I, I, I discovered I'm a sex addict and I've got to get out of the I'm industry. Glad. Well, okay. I'm glad so you can. I'm making, I'm making, I'm making changes in my life. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to better myself. Okay. Well, I mean, yes. Yeah, I mean, if you do want to apply for the position that we have posted, then please, by all means, you can come to the door, come to the restaurant while we open uh -huh. and get an application and submit it there. Okay, and how long is the uh, okay. interview process, or how long is the term that you're going to be searching for an applicant? Um, that I am not sure. I just know that once you submit an application, they normally call you folks to schedule um, an interview to come in. And by and by you, you, you from there. And, and by you folks, what what do you mean? Sorry. Well, I, I thought that you were trying meaning to Meaning the applicant? Well, I thought you were trying to hint around at no, some I mean, type of racial applicant. term. You said, you said you folks. Oh, no, 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 no. No, just my folks, meaning folks who apply here. Okay, Not so, nothing, so it, has, it has nothing to do with the Absolutely hue not. of my skin. Uh, well, of course not. Okay, but you would tell me if that's what you were saying. Correct. Yeah, of course, but I would never say anything like that. I'm... I'm okay. Brown skin myself, so okay. I'm not but, at all. But you do realize now that I have you by the balls that you said something like that, and now, now you have to give me a job or I'm going to tell. Um, I got you right by your huevos. No. Yeah, um, no, I've got you by the balls. No. So, no. so let's talk about my starting wage. What, I'm going to determine my own schedule. Sir, so I'm going to tell I, you the I'm hours. You know, um on what? Okay, so when you come to apply, yeah. you can put it on the application and when you're available. No, no, I'm going to tell you when I'm available and, and we'll, we'll work it out. But listen. Right, you can, yes, and you can put that on the application when you apply. Right, right, but where do I put on the application? Where, where do I available. put on the application about the racist woman on the telephone that says, you folks? Sir, I, I didn't say anything racial. You, you, I say folks I say it to everybody here. Yeah, but you said you folks. Yeah, you folks, like folks who are applying at our po at position. See, you, yeah. keep, you keep saying it, but you're emphatically, you're, you're emphatically, like, you're, you're Sir, emphasizing you. Know, I, you. I'm sorry. I, you. No, I, no, I just said folks. No, no, I didn't. <laughs> you're, ma you're making my baby cry now with, Sir, with all this mean, racist talk, ma'am. I apologize, but you know I I need to go. You are calling during the busiest time. I apologize. If you do want to apply, come to the door, fill out an application. Other than that, I'm yeah. But now, how am I supposed to feed my child? I have no I have no shellfish to feed my child now because of this.
Hello? We lost, we lost the patient. Oh, okay, good, good. Yeah. Fuck her. Cat's finally home. She's six minutes past when she claimed she was going to be. But we're, we're done now. I went, th- I went 36. I'm almost 40 minutes past time. Uh, so we're going to go watch a movie. We're watching um, Sleepaway Camp 2 and then followed by uh, Gutterball. Oh, my goodness. All right. I'd like to thank everybody for stopping by. We had a bunch of great guests tonight. We had RBCP stopping in, Ted Webb. We had the whole gang stopping in, participating. What a great combo. I'm telling you what. We couldn't do it without you all. That's right, our dear listeners. We love you each and every week right here on the Fight the Janitor Machine Show. Right. Ask them to bring a friend. Better yet, bring an enemy. You know what? They're welcome right here in the janitor's closet. Because that's right. We will convert you. If not, we'll send you off with a laugh. Thank you so much, everybody, for stopping in. We couldn't do it without our fearless leader, the Dwight the Janitor Machine. Thank you so much, Brother Dwight. 98.6 ML. 